cold showers are something which lots of people have tried and it gives you some sort of boost in terms of your immune system, like how you feel day to day and various other things. But I've had a question from Bree. Bree says, Lately I've been having a hard time getting the right environment to lucid dream. I've been reading other sites to see if there's any ways to help lucid dream faster and I've been seeing on ev almost every other site uh, taking cold showers is a way of lucid dreaming better or you know something that will help you lucid dream. I'm very unsure if cold showers will help with it. Do you think cold showers help with lucid dreaming? Now cold showers are something which helps you, will help you with various things in your life. Ba basically what they do, when you step underneath cold water as opposed to warm or lukewarm water, what happens is, because the water's cold, you know, and because it's colder than your body temperature, your body suddenly immediately starts to breathe deeply. You start to open up your entire esophagus and your, your breathing immediately deepens. You also notice that the blood will rush from your extremities, so from your limbs, inwards towards your organs and to keep your, your core temperature safe. And consistent. This is the same thing that happens if you were to jump into a into the ocean or if you were to have a shower underneath a waterfall. It's called the mammalian dive reflex and it's something your body does to protect yourself when you dive into cold water. That being said, it's also something that because of your body's response to the cold temperature is very beneficial for certain things. For example, there are these things called hormetic stressors which means small, it's the idea that small amounts of stress or resistance over time will make part of you stronger and so in this example the hormetic stressor is the cold water and the thing that it's strengthening is a your blood and you know how your blood flows around your body but also b your an immune system response your ability to adapt to and recover from or prevent illnesses and immune system problems things like hay fever the flu colds and any other airborne things that you otherwise would be susceptible to. By having cold showers every day, what you do is you strengthen your mucous membranes and your, your uh, respiratory system. It enables you to be less susceptible to these types of things. Now, this doesn't happen for everyone. And, you know, there are loads of stories online where people say about the benefits of it and it's very impressive. I myself, like from my personal experience, I have uh, noticed some of the benefits from cold showers. I've pretty much not had hay fever since I started cold showers, which was about two years ago. And every year before that, I always used to get really bad hay fever. Like every single summer, I would be, you know, my eyes would be streaming, I'd have to take antihistamines. That's all stopped. The reason I'm telling you this is because by having cold showers, you not only improve your circulation, your respiration, but also your internal body uh, homeostasis process seems to work better. Meaning, you don't feel the cold as much in winter and you stay cooler in summer if you have cold showers every day throughout the year. But that will help you sleep better, which will then lead to lucid dreams. But also, if you have a cold shower just before going to bed, what you'll notice is you can fall asleep faster, and then again, that will lead to lucid dreams. So, there's a lot of people online that say, with cold showers, you've probably heard about cold showers, and, and they always say to have them in the morning, not at night, because if you have them at night, it'll keep you up. It will keep you awake, just like if you have a coffee just before going to bed. That's not necessarily true. And I found that if, you ha if you're tired enough, you know, if you've been to the gym or if you've been doing things and having a busy day, by the time it comes to, you know, time to go to sleep, if you have a cold shower just before, um, just before going to bed, what you'll notice is that you fall asleep faster. And the reason for that is that when we fall asleep, our bodies take about one or two hours to slowly lower your body temperature to what's known as your sleeping temperature, which is a, a colder state than when you're awake. And it does this by, by deepening your breathing, making your breathing slower, and making your overall body temperature colder. So if you can speed this up by having a cold shower, if you're tired enough, your body takes that as a signal that it's time to go to sleep, and it sort of just goes to sleep faster. It's a very interesting idea, and it's certainly helpful for lucid dreaming, because you can, it's, it's like a, a sleep aid, a natural sleep aid. You just have a cold shower, and then when you get into bed, you'll feel nice and crisp and everything will just work better. You'll be able to sleep faster. So that's the answer to the question. I guess you should try it for yourself and let us know how it goes in the comments. Also, if anyone's had a cold shower and had any experience with this, 
Do you think it helps with lucid dreaming or am I just going crazy? Thanks for watching guys. This video and this channel are supported by my Patreon followers who are updated in the description of every video at the time of uploading. Please consider giving just a dollar a month to support this channel or just click the links in the description and you'll find links to various lucid dreaming products, articles, techniques and tutorials. If you did enjoy this video, please click the notification bell and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Why are you still watching this? You should have clicked one of my related videos by now, right? Or subscribed or gone onto my website or something like that.